take a place like Marjorie, there's limited space inside, but new action being taken by the city means in some cases there can be temporary outdoor cafes to expand capacity and restaurants aren't the only small businesses benefiting. It's challenging, I'm not going to lie. It's, uh, it's been a really rough ride. At Donna Moody's restaurant, the dining room isn't open yet, but she is offering carryout and considering her options. If I were to go out on the sidewalk, which we have a really wide sidewalk, so we would be very legal and we'd be not interrupting any ADA people trying to access the sidewalk. Thinking outside the box with sidewalk cafes, City leaders are making that idea more possible by offering free sidewalk and curb space permits to help restaurants that are only allowed to open at 50% capacity right now because of the pandemic. In West Seattle, Dave Montour, owner of West 5, says if his application is approved, he could fit four tables in a parking strip with social distancing in mind. We hope for public safety. We hope that the cases go down. So we're going to play our part in that. Retailers could receive help too because the city is offering free temporary merchandise display and vending permits. How helpful is that? I think it's really helpful. I think that the city was listening to the fact that um, consumers are worried about eating inside and that restaurants, once they have to socially distance, they need more space. According to SDOT, the goal is to streamline the process by prioritizing application reviews for businesses that qualify. Permits are good for up to six months. In Seattle, Natalie Swaby, King 5 News.